Hello, today we're going to create ShadowSox Linux proxy server. You don't need any technical knowledge to follow this tutorial, and you can use any of this cloud provider to create your proxies. Let's log in. You can create an account here if you don't have an account yet. Sign in. Okay, as you can see, I have a lot of active proxies and multiple accounts. There is no limit on this. Let's go accounts. You can here add your account. You can choose any of these providers and you need to follow the instructions. In less than one minute, you will be able to connect your account. It's really easy. Then go to proxies and you can create your proxies here. Let me first delete the past proxies. You can easily delete your proxies and instances here with one click and on the ocean also. Okay, I, I have five instances here and two instances there. So now let's create a AWS proxy. Let's create five proxies. You can also choose the location, the zone, the instance size. If you want better performance, you can choose one from these, but they are really expensive. So the recommended one is this one. And you, cho you can choose the port and let's create them. You can also create multiple jobs at the same time. Let's create Google Cloud. You can choose the location. Let's choose premium and let's choose one proxy here. Let's create them. And we just need to wait for the jobs to get created. Um, they will take take less than a minute, so let's just wait. Okay, the AWS proxies are done. Let's just wait for this Google Cloud proxies. Meanwhile, we can download the proxies. We can choose the format and we can sort by any of these parameters. Let's choose HTTP and IPv4. Let's download these proxies. Okay, six, six proxies got created. As you can see, it's really easy. Then we open our proxy checker and import the proxies and as you can see the proxies are working the status it's okay you can achieve better response times if you are close to the server and thanks for watching